It's now Jay Russell with Fox 15 Sports. Oh, check that out, right on time. Louisiana might be the seventh seed in the Sun Belt, but they won seven straight. Plus, these cats bounce out. The defending champs, Little Rock, 78 to 71. On to the next one, Georgia State, number seven, UL taking on number two, Georgia State in New Orleans. First half, Cajuns up 12 to eight, but the lead would not last for long. Jordan session, wide open, two-handed jam. UL cuts the lead in half. Then Georgia State next possession, Demarcus Simmons, three ball. Panthers take the one point lead, five straight for Georgia State. All right, Georgia State offense rolling. Simmons again, all the way to the cup, 19 to 13 GSU. But UL's offense, some life of courtesy of the senior. Jay Wright for three. Three of his nine first half points. UL ice cold in the first, under 33% from the field. The cage is down 35 to 26 at the break, and they wouldn't be able to rally. Jay Wright finishes off his career with UL with 27 points. All right, now going down the road to Baton Rouge, the hardest part of the job. LSU fires head coach Johnny Jones. After five seasons with the Tigers, the Perp and Gold squad struggled this full season. 2-16 and 16 in the SEC, 10-21 and 21 overall. Now, LSU Athletic Director Joe Aleva spoke with the media about why he needed to make the change. Well, I learned that um, the word fit is, not a, is a joke, okay? You know, fit. How, what's a fit? If you looked at uh, Johnny Jones, you think he would be the perfect fit. OK, I'm looking for a per I'm looking for someone who's a proven winner, has experience in, in the business and um, that can bring enthusiasm and passion to the to the program. Not to say that Johnny didn't do that, but it, it just didn't work out. I just love him explaining why he fired him. It's not like a joking matter, but you see his face and he's like, it just didn't work out. All right, now switch it over to baseball. Just because we're in a weather delay doesn't mean we should blame anyone, the weatherman, okay? So don't blame anyone for the two hour long lightning delay. Don't email this guy whose name is right below me, okay? <laughs> All right, hit the video. All right, the season moving along quickly. Already the last non-conference game of the year, Louisiana welcomes in St. Peter's. Gunny Leje came out hot, retiring. Two batters back to back. Walk it out, my man. All right, bottom of the second, Ishmael Edwards drills one to third. E6, baby, we're on base. And he's able to still second a couple of pitches later. All right, the best name in baseball, Handsome Monica, RBI single, Edwards at third, crowd going crazy. Even with the two hour long delay, these fans are still up. Checking the score right now, we have Louisiana up in the bottom of the fifth, St. Peter's zero. Want to contact me? Sports Story Ideas, KLAF Sports, J. Russell TV. I got gotcha. you. My man, Toy Thoring, liked the page, so you should go do it too. Of course I did. And you like mine too. At Toy Alright, I do, I do. I'm not going to fret. I, I do like his face <laughs> And too. we both like the Raging Cajuns. So Yo, Raging Cajuns, I mean, they came out hot. I mean, after Scott, I mean, <laughs> the, the lightning delay happened. Uh, you know, people were still up and everything, so, oh, you see that at the bottom right there. If you have concerns about the weather. All right, Scott will explain that after the break. <laughs>